What's going on, everybody? I want to um, give a little more update. I'm quite sure um, a lot of people already know. Not that it really make a difference to me, but to um, when I first heard the story about Black, um, Jay Black, who um, killed his ex-girlfriend and his ex-wife were two non-black women, women of non-color, Caucasian women. So these were two women of non-color who messed with this man mentally who was making good money, over 200000 a year. These women were nurses, man. So if these women, quote, lied and um, got false restrictions, orders on you, but yet the outcome is exactly what they put in and they order to have a restraining order against you, he had a gun. He threatened the woman. Um, the, 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 his girlfriend, she was scared. And I know a lot of women run with that. But like I said in my previous video, that women who can prove without a doubt that they are being harassed, being threatened, her and her children, if it could be proven, then the police department where they go to put in a file to complain. Okay, write out your complaint. But after that, if there's a process that the police will distribute you temporary, whatever, permit to carry, to protect you and your children, your home. I could get in more to this. But, you know, until someone really want to talk about this, because right now, of course, you got a lot of brothers who are already talking about it's dumb and it ain't going to work. Won't, won't, but it is what it is. I'm up here. I'm looking at what could benefit and change what's going on. But I want to say this before I get up out of here. This man did not have family like he stated in in the video I'm not going to replay it again I don't want to keep it's enough of that but he said he didn't have no family but yet because he chose to it didn't work out in your marriage okay you paying she didn't deserve to take a bullet woman pregnant carrying your baby that you chose to impregnate you kill her, she didn't. Men with emotional mindsets, of the mental, men who are mentally dysfunctional, not able to comprehend or deal in a civilized conversation with a woman, needs help. Sometimes getting counseling cannot help. They had to eliminate themselves, brothers. When you're going through something with a woman, the best thing you can do is not involve yourself with another woman. Don't do that. That's not how it go. Don't break up and get, jump right back in. No, don't listen. That's what women call themselves doing. They can leave a man and go to the next man. We are not women. There's a process. Men had to process shit out. And I'm not saying that my sisters do, don't do it either. But men, you, you, we, we have been known to, okay, I got somebody else. I got this. We're not healing. And we taking those situations, those thoughts, bringing it into this relationship. And soon as homegirl do something to simulate what your other girl did, now you smashing her. How many brothers can honestly admit that they haven't had sex in about two weeks? If you're a single brother. The average man don't have sex every single damn day. Not even a married man have sex every single damn day. As time go. 
So think about it. Eliminate the sex from a woman. What you got? A man who can think. Eliminate, eliminate sex from a man mind that, that, that he could think. Do you do do you feel to hear what? Do you think women sit up and wonder how you pounding another female? Wonder how you if she's swallowing you up and all that? No. But men wreck their brains because you, you you worrying about if another man is bigger than you, if, if he's making her scream and holler, if he can go down better than you, you can imagine in the positions of that, what she could do. And, and brothers lose their mind. But if men need to go sit down and talk to a counselor, do that. If he didn't have no friends, and I say to men who who try to, if you don't have a hobby, find a hobby. Okay, you big time make big money. So and you chose to date Caucasian women, okay? But you 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 you, you this man is what? And I'm not a race. Please don't take this out of content. I experienced this back in my younger days, and um, this is why I'm understanding. But this is why parents of young females or or nice, attractive women, they they parents have a, a a bad feeling to say, "Well, you shouldn't date." Him. No, we don't agree with you dating outside your race for things like this. Yes, we have. White man who killed black women, it's both sides. But what do the majority of family members say? I wouldn't date outside my race. Welcome to America. So, men, if you take your mind off of sex, off that... Who she with? What she doing? You can heal. You can get your mental mental mindset straight. But jumping from one woman to the next don't help. And this is why there are so many sisters who are in abusive relationships. And this is why I speak up as an applicant to, for, to, for the protection of sisters to speak up. And this need to go in law that women who can prove without a doubt that they were being uh, 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 abused, being threatened, being harassed. They should be able to carry a firearm that comes legally from the police station where they go to put in their complaint. Now, I'm from the state where this lady was at, they did not want to... um acknowledge her her restriction orders and she didn't have no permit so this is what the outcome is women are the sacrifice to mankind either it's for the good or for the bad women are the sacrifice for mankind Well, G love, y'all. I'll get back at you. Be safe. God bless you. I'll see you in my next commentary. Men who who are going through mental, mentally struggles, going through mental mindsets, going through problems. If it's dealing with a woman, take time away from women. Do other things to occupy your time. Make videos, do acts, rap, whatever it is to keep your mind off of having sex. You're going to thank me in the long run.